I'm glad I have the text on the screen from the previous lesson because it's a good way to segue from what we were talking about with the type tool into what we're going to talk about in this lesson, and that is the character panel. Now, the character panel actually goes hand in hand with the currently active panel that you can see over on the right hand side of the screen, and that's the paragraph panel. Now, we're going to get more into the paragraph panel in a later lesson. Now, the reason that I have my text highlighted right now is because I want to show you that what's going to happen once we go to the character panel, you'll see this is really where the tools are that we're going to need to utilize to adjust our text. Everything from the font itself to the text size to the kerning, tracking, letting, whether we have a stroke on our text, even getting in and adjusting the baseline shift and the scale of the text both horizontally and vertically. Now we're going to get more into what all of those different parameters mean coming up, but right now what I want to talk about is I want to talk about getting in and adding fonts to the character panel, whether you're downloading them from the internet or whether you're utilizing the Adobe Typekit.